Hello and a very warm welcome. Arsenal, Arsenal, Arsenal. Holy fuck. Oh my god. What has happened to Arsenal? They are dumb. They are dog shit at the highest level. I mean, Arsenal fans are the best at giving banter. They have to receive some banter. Holy shit, I can't believe how bad they are. I mean, everyone expected them to lose to Man City. But... 4-1, absolutely pummeled, they concede after two minutes, they have a goalkeeper that looked completely out of his depth, three of the goals were down to him, you could possibly say four, oh my god, no leaders, that's weak, that is dog shit, honestly, Arsenal have got about eight players who they need to keep, and they need to get rid of the whole, whole rest play the kids. The kids would put in a better performance than that. Honestly, I kind of feel for Arsenal. They've gone from a great football team, winning titles, to 15th in the league, out of the cup. When are they going to win another game? When was their last win? Genuinely being serious against Dundalk. I mean, they get a huge bounce because they top the group against Mulder, Dundalk and Rapid Vienna. Wow, but they can't buy a win. Arsenal, 100% is the worst Arsenal team in my lifetime. They are absolutely awful. They are dog shit. How the fuck, in God's name, did we lose to this Arsenal team? This Arsenal team is absolutely shite. Like, honestly, them players should have been absolutely embarrassed absolutely embarrassed they're actually disgracing the badge on their shirt and of course it's hilarious but i actually feel for the hardcore arsenal fans because they don't deserve this shit i mean they've seen this shit year in year out and nothing changes but they screamed they screamed for wenger out he constant consistently got them in the top four and now what's happened emery got them to a Europa League final, what happened, they got hammered, another hammer in tonight, 15th in the league, out the cup, FA Cup, I believe they have Newcastle, Boxing Day, they've got Chelsea, I mean, they're not, they are not beating Chelsea, and then they have Brighton, and that literally is a six-pointer, if they don't beat Brighton, they're genuinely, uh, I don't even want to think about it. Like, imagine being an Arsenal fan if they don't beat Brighton. I mean, they can't even beat Burnley at home. They are dog shit. Of course, they expect to lose tonight because it's Man City. But the same frailties have happened year in, year out, and nothing changes. They're weak, spineless, no characters, no leaders. I mean, look at the captain's armband. They literally pass it round like it's a parcel. You've got Granite Jacker, threw it down, told the fans to fuck off. Abamyang has it because he's their best player. He's not a leader, but because he's the best player. Oh, Abamyang will have it this week. Uh, other uh, against Everton, Rob Holding had it. Tonight, um, who had it tonight? Who had it tonight? Um, Lacazette, Lacazette. I mean, it's it's that's embarrassing in itself. I mean, four captains. I mean, against Chelsea, probably Leno will have it or someone. I mean, it's embarrassing. Like, Arteta, how is he still in a job? Like, it's criminal. He, Arteta, he could make history. He could take Arsenal down. Fuck me. I mean, wow. Unbelievable how bad Arsenal are. But it's kind of hilarious. I mean, they give it out, they give it out, so they've got to receive the banter when it comes their way. Arsenal, Arsenal, a great side. They literally went 49 unbeaten, winning titles. United and Arsenal used to fight for titles. Now Arsenal are fighting relegation. They get a massive bounce from winning their piss-easy Europa League to reality in the Premier League. Genuinely, someone comment down below when Arsenal last won a game. I know they drew to Southampton, but wow. 
I mean, we all expected a Man City whitewash, let's be real. I mean, that just shows the character of these players. Two minutes into the game, you're playing Man City, you give him a gift. Down the channel, crossing, keeper should come out and punch it. But he didn't look commanding at all, that goalkeeper. Run Arson. 1-0 down after two minutes. Then Arsenal actually scored. Pretty similar goal. Take it to the byline. Cross it in. Lacazette scored. Then it was 2-0. Free kick. Literally Massimo Taibi. Like, just completely dropped it. Oh my god, it was so bad. Um, I don't think he can play for Arsenal again, that goalkeeper. You don't like to slaughter goalkeepers, but he's clearly not up to it. The third goal, I think it was offside. Probably would have been if VAR was involved. Foden, beautiful finish. Dinked it over the goalie. And then 4-0. Who scored the fourth? Trying to think off the top of my head here. Off the back of that art display. I couldn't believe it. Holy fuck. Arsenal. Who scored the fourth? Oh, it was a cross in, wasn't it? Cross in the box. Mustafi with his hand up. I'm a German Cup winner. Yeah, you're a German shithouse and you need to be out the door. Um, wow. There's so many players in that team. Literally, I would keep Lacazette, uh, Martinelli, uh, Partey, Tierney, Gabriel, Leno. Probably keep that young striker, Balogun, is it? Um, holy shit. You got Pepe, £72 million pound flop. El Neni, Jacka, Sabios, just awful players. Oh, another one, Saka, that I would keep. Um, Smith Rowe as well, probably. I rate some of Arsenal have got some decent youngsters. Enketia not good enough. The goalkeeper tonight, not good enough. Bellerin, awful. Like his manager, just a model. Um, Mustafi, dog shit. Holding, dog shit. Kalazanach, dog shit. El Neni, Jacka. It's absolutely awful. And then you've got the biggest fraud, not even featured for weeks, months. You've got the biggest fraud, conning the club on nearly, f well, over 300 grand a week. Conning the club. The biggest fraud of them all, Mesut Ozil. That useless shit I was sat at home, just conning the club, bleeding the cup club dry I mean it's it's just comical from top to bottom uh, they literally left Highbury to go to the Emirates to compete with Bayern Munich they genuinely could be playing Brentford in the championship next season well maybe not because Brentford might come up Arsenal might go down it is hilarious Arsenal 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 <laughs> uh, same frailties same frailties, and it will continue till they get a ruthless manager to clear out the deadwood. Stan Kroenke is spineless. It, basically, we see that in a lot of clubs, an owner that just doesn't care. But, like, oh, it's clear to see what needs to happen. They need to get a ruthless, ruthless manager in. Arsenal fans need to be patient. They need to rebuild, clear the deadwood. Get some proper players in because half that team, they're literally it's a shambles to the badge. It's a disgrace to the name Arsenal. I grew up with Arsenal winning, like battling for trophies with Man United. Now they're fighting relegation. <laughs> Arsenal, they are the gift that keeps on giving and they keep getting shit players from Chelsea and they keep falling for it every time David Luiz uh, Petr Cech now they've got Willian they'll be picking up I don't know who they'll be picking up next bloody hell it's hilarious absolutely hilarious Arsenal my god what is going on at this football club they are oh, banter aside though Arsenal are a huge club they shouldn't be in this mess. It's it's criminal. It's absolutely criminal that Arsenal, 60,000-seater stadium, are in this mess. They literally can't buy a win. And I believe they played tea time, Chelsea, live on Sky Sports. 
They're not beating Chelsea. They are not beating Chelsea. Then they've got the six-pointer against Brighton. They literally a six-pointer. And if Brighton win that, holy fuck, Arsenal genuinely could go down. I mean, do I think they'll go down? No. But they could finish bottom half of the table, definitely. I mean, there's worse clubs than Arsenal, West Brom, Fulham, Brighton, Sheffield United. But if they lose to Brighton, oh my God. I watched the game tonight and you, it's just mentality. It's weak. I mean, two minutes into the game and they concede a basic goal down the channel, whip it in, keep her, come out and punch it. Just give Jesus a free header. Arsenal, the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> Fucking hell. They are dog shit. I wonder what odds you would have got on Arsenal getting relegated this season. Arsenal. Arsenal. <laughs> Banter FC.